Welcome back to NBC5 News at 6. A memorial bench lovingly made by a Grants Pass teen has become the target of thieves. Now the community is hoping someone will step forward to help. NBC5's Emily Beal spoke with people who find special meaning in the bench. She's in the newsroom with more. Emily. Kristen, today I spoke with one of the boys who was closest to the two men memorialized through this bench. He's confused and shocked that this happened. Last year, Grants Pass High School lost two students, Max Belknap and Ryan Merker. Belknap and Merker were on the track team at GPHS, but the team didn't just lose teammates, they lost friends. For Mark Hubbard, the loss wasn't just a track teammate, it was his best friend, Max. It was, it was really hard. Mark Hubbard was Max's best friend. You could tell at the beginning of the school year that no one really knew what to do or how to feel going into the beginning of the school year. Like just everything was different. Now track runners in the school are suffering another loss. The bench lovingly built as a memorial to the teens has been vandalized. The wood forming the seat stolen. I'm pissed and offended someone would go out there and do something like that. The bench was put in nearly a year ago by Belknap's younger brother Lucas as part of his Eagle Scouts project. Hubbard says the bench is more than a seat to those who knew Belknap and Merker. We get to look at it every day that we were here, so that was great. When he found out part of the bench had been stolen, he couldn't believe it. The reason I'm here is to not only work out, but I also came to see if it actually was true. I mean, obviously it was, but I just, I just can't believe someone would do something like that. Like, and now, more than anything, all Hubbard wants and the school wants is to have the piece that represented their fallen friends back. Honestly, at this point, I think people would just be happy just to have the bench back. Like, I, I wouldn't, like, hate the person. I would just be happy that the bench was back. If you know anything about the part of the bench that has gone missing, you're urged to contact GPHS or the Grants Pass Police. Live in the newsroom, Emily Beal, NBC5 News.